I just mm -hmm. wanted to ask you, um, you're, I'm sorry, you're how old now? You're 70. 70. Um, um, you had a stroke from which it seems that you've bounced back pretty agilely. Well, the top bit's working all right. <laughs> yeah. Um, you have been so prolific and written so many wonderful plays. Do you feel any diminishment of the creative powers at all as you get older as a writer, or are they sharper than ever? Well, I, I, I used to run the theater in Scarborough, and I retired last year, uh, and this is my first year just writing and directing. Mm. Um, and uh, as I said to someone, they said, do you miss running the theater? And I said, no, no, not at all. <laughs> um, I now have none of the responsibility and all of the pleasure. Mm. So, um, but I'm, I'm, lo I'm, when I had the stroke, it was the very first time for the first few weeks after the stroke when I had no ideas in my head and I felt terribly, terribly lonely and empty. Mm. And then I said, okay, pull yourself together. You've, you've got a back catalogue that's pretty big. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, y you can start reworking that. Um, so I was going to redirect some revivals. And then a tiny little germ of an idea suddenly came to me. And I thought, oh, thank God. Um, I, I've still got ideas and I've written two or three since the stroke. And uh, I'm getting stronger every day. I'm just exercising that writing.